For thousands of years, we're told that man's strongest alcoholic drinks were only around 10%, until an Arabic Egyptian alchemist in the 9th century AD finally used the art of distillation to concentrate alcohol into a fermented beverage and make liquor. We have evidence that ancient Egyptians, Mesopotamians, and Chinese all had knowledge of distillation, but nobody thought to use it for alcohol until the 9th century. They would make perfumes and concentrates for medicine, but no liquor. Instead, they were satisfied with rice wine, grape wine, mead, beer, and in the Americas, polke. But nobody thought to distill their drinks to make them stronger. A large part of alchemy is reducing things down to their base materials. Distilling is a way of doing this. Alchemists would consider the practice finding the original essence or spirit of whatever material they were working with. In this case, the spirit of the beer or wine is the pure alcohol, which is why liquor can also be called spirits.